Did the ten plagues of Egypt really happen? Or were they just natural disasters written as miracles? From rivers turning to blood to darkness covering the land, some scientists say there's a logical explanation. But others believe only divine power could shake a kingdom like that. The book of Exodus records ten plagues sent by God to convince Pharaoh to free the Israelites. Water to blood, frogs, gnats, flies, livestock disease, boils, hail, locusts, darkness, and finally, the death of the firstborn. Some propose a chain reaction of natural events. Red algae turning the Nile crimson could have driven frogs to flee, insects to multiply, and diseases to spread. Volcanic eruptions might explain the darkness, and hail mixed with fire could be meteorological chaos. But even if nature played a role, the timing was perfect. Each plague striking Egypt but sparing the Israelites. Coincidence or divine orchestration? That's the mystery. The plagues of Egypt weren't just punishment. They were revelation. Each one showed that nature itself answers to its creator. Whether through science or miracle, the message was the same. No power on earth stands above God. So, what do you believe were the ten plagues acts of nature or proof of God's direct hand in history? Comment your thoughts and follow Curious Bible Facts for more stories where faith and science collide.